In regards to a black excellence, he's a part of that campaign. He has like the beyond eye, you know, he could see into what's happening in music, what's gonna happen. You kinda like gotta put people in a world to understand what's going on. I gotta give you the alphabet to this language that I have. And baby steps, you gonna pick it up. My name is Dominique Purdy, Koreatown Odyssey. I was born Koreatown. You know, that's part of where the name comes from, obviously, because of like being odd, but just being like, there's not, nobody doing what I'm doing. You know what I'm saying? And people around me know that too, you know? Uh, Stop being lazy, I've set this up in here. Pee Wee's Playhouse, let's go. The boldness comes from wanting to get an idea out and see it in the physical world. On the creative front, he's somebody I see he has a lot of potential, whether it be music or his comedy or his acting. And I'm just here to, you know, help uh, put a frame around it and help him, you know, grow further into his artistry. Everybody has different strength, you know, and, and we lean into that and we all bring different things and look at things through different angles. But at the end of the day, it's like, we want to do stuff that no one's done before, or we want to just push the boundaries of what you can do. And I think that's like the thing that brings us all together. So I had an album come out called Is This For Real? So obviously this is the cover, right? Um, and there's like this, you know, Korean text on here. And it's, it's on the back as well. You know, my confidence comes from having the desire to do the thing that I want to do, to manifest an, an idea and see it and, you know, receive joy from it existing. I don't, I don't know how to do everything that I would want to do, but I know people that have those expertise. I, I don't really do merch, you know? I'm really, I'm picky like that because I wanna do stuff that is gonna last or, you know, like that matters, not just throw away merch. My homies Chico and Esco, you know, they source vintage and he was like, man, there's so many shirts in the world. You don't really need to make new shirts. Uh, we're upcycling old shirts. What we're doing is we're sourcing blanks to print for the merch for Koreatown Oddity because there is enough clothing in the world. Like, we should just print on that type of stuff, you know? No, it's anything. Like, it could this be is anything just... that just is like a blank canvas that we think like, yo, that would be some ill merch. It's kind of just like catering to anybody. It's like even someone that just looks at it from just like a clothing aspect, they'd be like, yo. You know, so that's kind of the ill part about it is like we were saying like, People could debate like, oh, I got the best one, you know, like I got I got the green stripe with the whatever, and then it's like they're not wrong. In their mind, it might be the best one, and, and someone else could dispute it. Like, no, I got the best one. Like, you know, when we have an event, we have the shirts there. They all got different cuts because they're all different kinds of shirts. So I want people to have that feeling like, oh, this is a piece I'm gonna keep, yeah. you know. I would just like have tapes at one point. They came in with the cassette. I'm like, nobody messing with cassettes, <laughs> you know? Man, K-Town got that, that soul, he got that insight. He knows how to tell a story and relate to people. Dom is like a, I think a pure like Los Angeles artist in like the truest sense. You know, he's very unique, very unique sort of like energy, very unique artist. He's truly like doing his own thing. And I think it's been like that probably since he started making music. Man, it's it's an honor and a blessing to be able to like be a part of something that's gonna stand the test of time. I even try to make music with that in mind. Hey, maybe they don't get it right now. Maybe some people are gonna be slow. Maybe it's gonna be a slow burn. But maybe in like 10 years, people will be like, yo, you was on something, bro. Like, and people gonna get into it. Just like with anything that's great, and the mission is to 
let me leave the things, let me do the stuff, let me inspire the people, let the people inspire me, and let's keep that good energy recycling. Yeah. That's it.